Hi everybody. Um, so today I'm going to talk to you guys about dark circles. Um, I think it's just such a common concern um, here in the clinic. People come in and they want the best remedies and the best um, eye creams. So I've picked out my top products that I feel work really well for this concern. So what actually causes um, dark circles around the eyes? So there's so many factors to take into account. So a lot of the time it's actually hereditary. Um, it could be stress, it could be sleep deprivation, it could be diet, hormones. Um, some people have just a thinness around the eye area as well. So again, it's just so hard to actually pinpoint and that can be quite frustrating, but there is so many good products um, and ingredients that will target um, the eye area to make it, um, I suppose, less visible. Um, sometimes we don't have that magic wand to take away the dark circles and that's important that, you know, we meet people's expectations, but there's definitely is eye creams and really good concealers, <coughs> excuse me, that will um, disguise dark circles. And I suppose a lot of our eye creams that I'm going to be recommending as well, um, tie into uh, treating puffiness around the, the eye area as well, which is another common uh, concern. So I'm going to go through some of the eye creams now with you. So starting with one of my favourite eye creams, it's the Environ Vita Peptide Eye Gel. I'm sure you guys have seen it being mentioned quite a bit. The reason why it is just so popular is because excuse me, it's the array of ingredients that is all in the one bottle. So we've got vitamin A, we've vitamin C, we've got hyaluronic acid, we've got peptides, and to have that all in the one bottle is just amazing. So you're going to treat um, concerns such as dehydration, aging, peptides are going to tighten and tone the area, Vitamin A and vitamin C are going to, I suppose, brighten up the skin. So it definitely ties in with someone that has dark circles, but you're going to get so many added benefits to using this eye cream. And that's why it's one of my top, top uh, favorite eye creams. So the next product I want to talk to you guys about is from the Murad range, and it's the Dark Circle Corrector um, eye cream. And this is such a popular product from ourselves. And I love seeing a product that people come back in again and again for. This is specifically designed to treat dark circles. Um, so you've got some vitamin C in here in the form of L-ascorbic acid, and that's going to brighten up your complexion around the eye area. It also has red and brown algae in there as well. So it's actually gonna help with puffiness as well. Super hydrating, anti-aging, but mainly designed to treat dark circles. So for someone then that has that dryness around their eye area and they love the, fo the formulation of a cream um, and are obviously trying to, you know, target um, dark circles as well. The Aluma Intense Brightening Eye Cream, I absolutely adore the feel of it. I just love um how it feels on the skin you know it targets the dryness and the reason behind that is because it has your peptides and it also has your hyaluronic acid in there as well as well as your brightening agents so this is going to be a really really good um eye cream for someone that is feeling that little bit drier but just wants to target um the dark circles as well so another fantastic eye cream I want to talk to you about is from the Illumiere range. Absolutely adore Illumiere. Illumiere is another cosmeceutical brand that we um, have here in the clinic and uh, love everything that Illumiere does, uh, like I do with a lot of the brands that we carry. Um, but with this one, it's for all uh, skin types. And again, you're going to get multifunctional benefits from this eye cream. It has uh, peptides and rosemary is an ingredient that you'll find in a lot of eye creams as well. It increases the blood flow and especially in the eye area, that's gonna be fantastic for uh, dark circles. So this one has your amazing peptides and your rosemary in it as well. And it's in the form of a cream, so nice and nourishing around the, the eye area as well. Um, so yes, you'd any eye cream that I've mentioned, um, always use it twice a day. Twice a day is always going to get you the best results. I know a lot of people in the morning tend to skip the eye cream, but if you can, especially trying to get results and, um, you know, uh, get the best out of your product, I would use it twice a day. 
So next up, we have a product from the Yonka range. Yonka is all about delivering the most um, amazing natural formulations of like plant extracts um, and just more of a he more holistic approach to treating the skin. And like I mentioned with, um, I think it was the Murad, um, when you see someone coming back in for the same product, um, it just gives me such an indication that that person's getting the most amazing results. So I love people. Uh, I love seeing people come back in uh, to repurchase the same product because it's just such a great, um, I suppose, testament that the product is um, working. So um, the Phyto Contour, the main ingredient is rosemary. And rosemary is um, an ingredient that is just going to stimulate blood flow. And especially in the eye area and around the eye area, it's delicate. It's much more thinner than uh, the rest of the skin on our, our face. So we need that blood flow and especially for dark circles. So any of the Yank Yonka fans out there or someone that wants to try something different, this is called the Phyto Contour and is specifically designed for puffiness and dark circles. So guys, there you have it. Um, now, when I say my top picks, um, yes, these are my top picks, but we've so many different eye creams and we've so many different brands so obviously i can't mention them all today so if you are currently using an eye cream and you're a bit unsure or if you have any questions on it um please send the questions my way and i will get back to you um and if there's any other concern that you would like me to talk about i definitely want to jump on and discuss puffiness i think that's another huge concern um the reasoning behind puffiness and what can we be doing at home to sort of um enhance our products there's so many devices that we could be bringing into our regime so what i'll do is i will pop the link up onto these um eye products that i mentioned today and again if there's anything else i can help you with please um pop the questions in and i look forward to talking to you again thank you so much